There's an odd phenomenon taking place across the world that a lot of the greenies don't want you to know about. And that's because it relates to one of their pet hobby horses, renewable energy. Renewable energy, of course, is supposedly attractive because it's so cheap, it's virtually free. Well, that's what they want you to believe. But have you noticed the more of this free energy there is, the more expensive our power bills actually become? We're also told renewable energy is effective and it can actually replace the legacy baseload power systems that are currently fueled by coal and gas. Well, that too is a fantastic claim. For all the hundreds of billions of dollars spent on renewable energy, it comprises less than 16% of global energy supply. And the vast majority of that, it comes from burning wood. Wind and solar actually account for just 4% of the mix. The Greenies, though, will tell you that's not true. Crony capitalist outfits like the World Economic Forum will claim wind and solar account for 10% of global energy. Well, they're wrong. And they conveniently ignore burning of biomass as well. My point being, the data you're told about wind, solar and the benefit of renewables is cherry-picked to suit a cause. The truth is much less effective than the spin in pushing their cause. But there's another inconvenient truth. Wind turbines across the world are collapsing at an alarming rate. Bloomberg reports the frequency of combusting and collapsing turbines is spiking. And one insurance underwriter said, we're seeing these failures happen in a shorter time on the newer turbines, and that's quite concerning. Now, we know these monuments to green grift are a danger to wildlife. They kill birds. We've got whales being washed up on beaches. Now they're catching fire too. It makes you realise the green dream is neither safe nor effective.